In order to get started with XTUML for model-driven development, we need to get tooled up. The place to do that is at XTUML.org. Here you see the XTUML.org homepage, and in the additional downloads, we can click the link to go to the download page. From there, we can choose either a Windows or a Linux version of the XTML editor. I'm going to choose Windows and save the file. Once the download completes, I simply launch the XTML editor installer, and this brings up the installation wizard. The wizard will guide you through all details of the installation, including the location that you want to install to. This looks good to me, so I'll click Next. Then it will ask if we want to create a desktop shortcut. Sounds good, so say yes to that. And then the installation progresses. This can take a few minutes. Once the installation completes, the README file will be shown and the XTML editor shortcut will appear on your desktop. You're now ready to launch the application.